feels like you're 100 miles away. It's the ideal first stop as you're going north. It's the ideal first night in Scotland. We're a small country house, so you are looking at a relaxing country house holiday. The thing that we're trying to do here is to give people the feeling of being almost a home away from home. So it's about good food, great hospitality, being looked after, comfy beds at night and a lovely environment in which just to relax. Lockdown Country House was built back in 1846 on the Rosneath Peninsula. Uh, the Rosneath Peninsula is a very hidden little part of Argyll and was once owned by the Duke of Argyll uh, and now has uh, a number of people from all over the area coming to use this as a holiday area but also there's a lot of people who use this to commute to Glasgow so it's really handy for all kinds of activities. People are always surprised at just how close we are to Glasgow. You can get into Glasgow Airport and be here in 45 minutes. Sailing is huge in the area and we have six moorings sitting out there which we, we maintain and it's always lovely to see our sailing guests come to visit. Further afield there's lots of things to do. You can get out on, onto Loch Lomond, it's only 20 minutes away and there you've got all the, the pleasure cruises, canoeing, biking, hill walking, although there's some great hill walking just at the top of this loch here up in Aracher. So there's loads to do. At Knock Dairy Country House is on right down on the loch side and when we say that we are literally almost a stone's throw. The hotel itself uh, has 14 bedrooms um, and they're all that little bit different. There's not two that are the same. We've got four master bedrooms. Uh, they look out over the front of the hotel and have uh, lovely views of the loch side. King size four poster beds with a little touch of luxury so there's a roll top bath just if you're looking for that night away. But we've got contemporary rooms and traditional rooms which are a little less expensive which makes it a very cost effective good value for money stay. The contemporary rooms are in the new part of the building so they've got a slightly more contemporary feel but the traditional bedrooms I, I personally are my favourite because they're a little bit quirky, they've got some lovely old antique furniture in them um, and some lovely light. We also have little doubles, we call them wee doubles and they're just ideal for the single traveller or looking for a really inexpensive night stay. So we've got f all those four different types of rooms but for the couple who want to get married or the couple for an anniversary we have the library suite which is the top of the house. Now the library suite is known that because it was the original library for the country house when it was a private house. So it's a lovely perfect little secret hideaway if you're coming for a, a little holiday or a little romantic runaway. Eating good food in a lovely relaxed environment I think is, is a real pleasure and a real luxury. So that's something we really focus on here. From the venison to the eggs that we get are all produced in the local area. We're very lucky in that respect. But seasonality is another big, big thing for us. We really do try to cook with the seasons and that just means there's great variety on the menu. So for us, cooking good food and making it as seasonal and as local as possible is a real pleasure and really part of the Knock Dairy experience. Knock Dairy's been going 11 years now and we've always been known as a little bit of a hidden gem. Well, we're quite keen to be not so hidden anymore and hopefully what's helping us is the fact that we're beginning to get some accolades. Not only are our guests beginning to write in and tell people you've got to go and try Knock Dairy, but some of the, the bigger organisations are beginning to recognise us and the, recently we were really, really lucky in picking up a couple of awards at the Scottish Hotel Awards. In fact, for the last couple of years we've picked up awards there, not just for the food but for, for hospitality. And that's really pleasing because that's really what we're about, is about giving the all-round hospitality experience. Mm -hmm.